Good evening, everybody from St. Augustine, Florida. Florida's first Bucky's opened today. If you're not aware where Bucky's is, it's this massive gas station fresh out of Texas. This gas station in St. Augustine, Florida, 120 gas pumps, and it go all the way around the side and the back. And I've got to admit, I am a Bucky's virgin. This is my first time coming to a Bucky's. I've been past Bucky's in Texas. When you see these signs for miles advertising the gas station, I was like, what the heck is that? They're usually advertising food and all kinds of other things, but I've never stopped in because my eyes are usually on the prize with Jack in the Box or other types of things that I can't get in Florida. The Bucky's opened up this location today. Exactly one month from today, they opened their next Florida location in Daytona Beach. So I filled up my tank. Gas is actually 20 cents cheaper here than it was anywhere else around in Florida. I got this giant Bucky over here, and it appears that it is a selfie spot. Get a little bit closer look here. There's a Bucky. So Bucky's, not your typical gas station, not a grocery store, huge. They've got everything, as you can see outside here. Fire pits, ice, small and large. And by the way, for everyone that says you can't pay people $15 an hour for minimum wage, take a look at these wages that they're offering people. So minimum wage here for cashier, $15 to $17 an hour. And by the way, three weeks paid time off and a 401k. So we've got barbecues, smokers, wood, oh, tabletop grills. Oh yeah, Ooh, it smells good. Crawfish washers, fish washers, coolers, Bucky's rocking chairs, Bucky's director chairs, folding chairs. The cheapest folding chair, six bucks. The vented chair, thirty-five. Directors. 35 and this high back rocker is $60 and you can't forget the kids or that folding table we have that folding table not with Bucky's on it though and it never unfolded the right way maybe Bucky's has perfected it Bucky's sports cabana 30 bucks and we're going in holy go there's a lot of people Whoa. it's like a Jess shirt 15 bucks on the shirts and the hat. Bucky, $13. Bucky's towels, more Bucky shirts. Feeling the Bucky vibes. Greetings from Bucky's in Florida. That's the shirt to get. Or this, this, this is it. Bucky's chips. To give you an idea of how much of an event this is, look at all of these people. Also, mask required, but not everywhere here, that's for sure. All kinds of snacks like you would expect. Soda. Restrooms are the cleanest in the business, supposedly. We got beaver nuggets. Sea salted caramel. Bucky's gold nugget bubble gum. Beaver buddy animal crackers. Bucky's creamy pralines. More beaver nuggets. Bucky's mugs. Yukon mugs, look at this. Beaver nuggets and chocolate. Bucky's pecans. The loading up begins. Bucky fudge. Oh, like a sampler. It's right. Heavy as always. Goes in the basket. Snacks, snacks, snacks. Candied jalapenos. Bucky's cheese e curls. Bucky's chips. Bucky's salsa. Whoa, Bucky's jelly and cookies and popcorn balls and caramels and jams. Grandma Gigi's pepper jelly. Candy, 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 candy. Oh, coolers. And they got different types of coolers. Oh, back to clothing, my favorite. Bucky's hats. Cross from the hats. Bucky's honey. Honey butter, pecan honey butter, holy cow. 
Bucky's coffee. Little wine glasses. Rib rub, clucker sauce. My favorite, Jordan almonds. Crack your teeth. And all of this is beer. Beer, beer, beer. Bucky's koozies for cans or bottles. I love that they have the name brand like Skinny Pop and then right next to it is Bucky's Tip Top Pop. 40 cents cheaper. Barbecue, camping stuff, home, logs, charcoal. Just like all you need to go camping, like disposable stuff. There's no Bucky's condoms. I mean, that's, you would think that that would be a surefire hit. Tons and tons of snacks. Bucko snack rings. You like ices? They got all kinds of flavors. Looks like 16 different ones. How about coffee? You got iced coffee right here. And then they've got all this regular coffee and tea. And if you like soda, they even have Bucky's brand. Root beer, cherry lime, homestyle lemonade, blue cream, on and on. Look at this. More and more and more and more. And this is nuts. The Bucky says barbecue, tacos, colossians, bakeries, dipping dots, chicken and steak, sausage and jerky. And speaking of jerky, look at all this jerky. More Bucky's merchandise. Bucky neck pillow, Bucky boogie boards. More Bucky's, Bucky's, Bucky's. Bucky's socks. Bucky's baby stuff. Oh, Bucky's Grateful Dead road tripping. Bucky's pillow pet. Bucky's towels. Bucky volleyball. Oh my God. Oh no. Bucky's ducks. Bucky's lounge pants. I love you to Bucky's and back. Shot glasses, coasters. Oh look, Bucky's is Irish now. <laughs> or Bucky's wine. Bucky's cap guns. Oh, the memories. So they also sell the fire disc here. We used to have an older version of this when we lived in Staten Island, New York. It was amazing. There was more walk with a barbecue attachment. But I have watched many YouTube videos on this device recently, and I can't seem to find the willpower enough to pull the trigger. There's also a lot of non buckies things here, too. Nice stuff. Get some gas, get some food, get some snacks, and drinks, and a bathing suit. This is right outside St. Augustine Beach, by the way. A little women's section, and also sandals and water shoes. Oh my God, look at how cute that is. <laughs> Columbia hat. Mine got wrecked, I have that hat. License plates with names, and they actually have my name. No Bort. Nylon outdoor mat. Bucky's yoga pants. Look at the inside. That was a quick turnaround for you. More Bucky's yoga pants. Dog treats. Whiskey helps. Savage Mom, is this from Rick Savage? You got Woody here. Buzz. There's a whole home section here and women's. Kids items, Mary, bath bombs, candles. Does Kramer know about this? Check out these letters, they're six bucks a piece. They've got all the cheesy signs. Family. Jesus, I need this thing for sure. <laughs> and we're back in crazy land. So you got all kinds of nuts. The fudge, more nuts. But look at this fudge that they have. 
fresh, made on site. Look at those nuts. You can order some food here. Texas barbecue. Who needs four rivers? Look at those brisket sandwiches. Oh my god. Look at these sandwiches. Brisket. Beaver chips. Sliced turkey sandwich. Sausage. Sausage on a stick. So we can order some food here. Tacos. Burritos, fish taco, or chicken or beef fajita. All right, no thanks to the chips. Complete the order. 481, two tacos, 1113. Bucky's face masks. So Bucky's is known for having the cleanest bathrooms around. Let's take a peek in. All this artwork on the way in here. And it is pretty spotless. Check it out. All the doors here. Nice. People cleaning as soon as you're done. So the crowd started to die down a little bit while we were in there, but it's packed. We got some food to try. We got a couple tacos and some brisket and pulled pork. There are no seats here. So that's one thing that is a drawback. <laughs> they got a little rain. <laughs> I know people sometimes poke fun like if we eat at Wawa in our older videos because Wawa has good food. They, yeah, they do. Good sandwiches and stuff. But um, I actually like Wawa sandwiches better than Publix so everybody can hate on me for your pub subs. But there's no seating here so if any of the food that you get you're going to be eating it back in your car or take it to go. So uh, that's one drawback in my book. The bathrooms were super clean um, and they did have like a full-time attendant just cleaning after everybody goes to the bathroom. But um, mask policy here is uh, just non-existent so yeah. I don't even think that they have a sign in the door or anything either requiring it so it's just not um, there. So food wise we got pulled pork and a sliced brisket sandwich. Let's open them up to see what they look like. The sandwiches were reasonable. They're six bucks a piece and they are making them there as we saw in the video. Yeah. So here's brisket and pulled, pulled pork. pork. I'm going to try the pulled pork, but I'm not going to show myself <laughs> shoving food in my mouth. <laughs> Mary had a piece of the brisket and the verdict. Not bad. The pulled pork is really good. Sweet. Now I'm going to try this brisket. Mary's trying the pulled pork. Mm. And the verdict. No, it's actually pretty good. The brisket's good. Um, it's not the most tender brisket it is kind of sweet a little fatty so I just still I mean, if I was drinking it to get four rivers or Bubba Lou's or things like that like I don't think it's as good as that but it's really good a couple of gristly spots that I've had into but I mean who's going to gas station for brisket I mean for as far as gas station brisket goes this knocks it out of the park <laughs> And these are the tacos. This is chicken fajita taco. And this is the beef. Can't really see much inside unless if I unravel it, it'll fall yeah, apart. Mm. Now I gotta be honest. The chicken taco, that was damn delicious. What'd you think of the beef one? It's good. Mm. Wow, the beef taco is even better. Mm -hmm. This is awesome. We finished our meal. You can see just tons and tons of pumps. And even around the back, more pumps. And they do have diesel, but they do not allow trucks in here. And go all the way around here. We are gonna head home from St. Augustine. We've got bags full of snacks and other goodies, but we'll get to that another time. For now, this is Bucky's St. Augustine. Next month, Bucky's Daytona. We'll be there also. Thanks a lot for coming along. Thank you very much for all of your likes, comments, and subscriptions. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Have a great night. I'll see you guys.